say pretty eyes, I meant the term of green eyes. What's good guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, we are going to be discussing Damien and Bianca from the Prince Family, DB Nation, and all their many channels. <laughs> I don't really like doing videos like this because I don't necessarily like to downplay anyone or talk bad on anyone, but I was on Twitter and I just was like seeing so much stuff and it was kind of irritating, especially when you are a light bright, when you are AKA a light skinned person in society's eye, you know, there are a lot of colors out there and colorism always speaking up for my sisters who are darker than me because I mean, I have sisters and siblings period that are darker than me. So I would never want someone to intentionally treat them wrong because their skin is darker and my skin is lighter. Plus I have been in situations where I have darker friends and you know, our coworkers at work pin up, try to pin us against each other. So when it comes to the colorist thing, I really don't like it. So I wanted to talk a little bit about the video that they did, their delivery video of their precious baby girl, Nova. As um, soon as the video came out, as you guys seen, Bianca was talking about how, you know, she assumed her daughter would have pretty eyes. And my thing is, what concise of pretty eyes? You know, growing up for me, I hated when people said pretty eyes because I just felt like their eyes, and I think at a younger age, I was always well ahead of my time, if that makes sense. I always felt like you shouldn't judge someone based upon how they looked or if a person is lighter, they look better. They're classified as, you know, looking better. So she did the video. Twitter ate her ass up pretty much. And all of the big YouTubers, you know, were commenting on it. You know, I was looking at what uh, Jackie was saying about it. You know, um, Aaliyah J. And I even tweeted to Aaliyah J that the first thing that I was thinking about when my daughter was born is, was she breathing? Because you guys, if you guys have not looked at that story time when my daughter was born her shoulder got stuck my daughter had 10 seconds to get out or she would have lost oxygen and she could have died it was nothing but the grace of god my daughter is here and that's why i celebrate her life just like my son who's a heart warrior i'm not thinking about do they have my eyes because i don't care about that when i look at people i tr I treat them depending on how they treat me. I don't care how you look, but if you're disrespectful, you don't respect me, you know, you're racist or whatever it is, I don't want anything to do with you. But anywho, I don't want to keep mumbling on that. So I today seen another video of them. I think they did it on the Prince Family channel. They have a lot of freaking channels. And this is why another thing, they should have been canceled, but we'll get to that. So they try to clear up everything that they've been talking about. And this is where they should have just shut up and not said anything or just maybe gave an apology because they made like the big blogs, <laughs> that which is crazy to me. These people made the big blogs and it's really sad that they made the blog for being colorist. So you see in the video, Damien, Bianca and the baby, they're talking about how she, you know, gave the, why she said the baby had pretty eyes because the nurse asked her something, yada, yada, yada. But what got me is she was talking about brown eyes. So she basically tried to downplay people with brown eyes. And I'm just sitting there looking at the video, like I can't even watch this shit because the way they did the editing, like she says, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna post a clip so you guys can see what I'm talking about because it's a little easier when you do a video. So I'm gonna click on it. They don't ever judge a book by its cover. Mm -hmm. A lot of people were saying, a lot of people was judging us off a 30 second clip that was posted on these other platforms without even watching a full video or even knowing who he is. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So like I said, how they gonna judge if we came from the bottom? They don't even know us. But first and foremost, I wanna give, we wanna give an apology 
mm -hmm. to all our fans, all our supporters, all the real DNB supporters, all the real Prince family supporters. And uh, we just want to give y'all an apology because it's a lot of um, like you know disheartening There's stuff that's going that's, that's being said about us. Mm -hmm. That's absolutely not true. Yeah. You know, not true so we just want to apologize to you guys for even having to deal with this. You know what I'm saying? You guys deserve you know the apology the most at the end of the day. I mean, that's just that's what it is. So I want to we want to start off with an apology. So she don't even she's look like she's you apologetic. She's like, how's him crossing? Oh, I gotta do the video. You just want to jump into talking about the video itself. This is tough, tough. Let's, let, let's jump. Let's talk about the video itself. Okay, so basically, there's this clip going around, and it's not even a full clip. They put clips together to make it seem like it was one clip. Uh, people are going around saying that. I don't want my daughter because I said she doesn't have pretty eyes. Let me see her. Um, in the video, I was looking at her and I said, I was talking to the nurse and the nurse was like, if they're dark right now, they're always going to stay dark. And I made a statement, yeah, because when I was born, my eyes were blue and now my eyes are green. And then I looked at her and I said, oh, I wish you had pretty eyes. Now, when I said, I wish you had pretty eyes, I didn't literally mean she doesn't have pretty eyes. You know what I'm saying? I didn't mean, oh my gosh, my daughter has ugly eyes. When I say pretty eyes, I meant the term of green eyes. Because, Damien, have you ever got a compliment about your eyes? No. No? Okay. My sisters have never got compliments about their eyes. My mom always told me that everywhere we went, everybody was like, oh my gosh, your daughter has such pretty eyes. Brown eyes don't get complimented like green eyes or hazel eyes or blue eyes. Now when I said to her, I wish she had pretty eyes, I didn't mean it as if she has ugly eyes. My daughter's beautiful. I wanted my daughter to be here, you know what I'm saying? I went through a long, a long process just for her to be here today. I didn't mean it. I just, I should have said, I wish you had green eyes. I wish you had my eyes. Because me and you both talked about it. Everybody talks about what do you think she'll look like? Matter of fact, there's like thousands of comments. Ooh, what? You don't want the password no more? <laughs> I guess not. There's like thousands of comments on our Instagram. We just gonna throw it on screen. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's like, bless, bless you. you. Mama. Bless, bless you. you. It's about a thousand comments on our Instagrams, on our Twitter, even on our YouTube videos. They still love y'all. Watch all that because they have too many damn ads. But what kind of size is a pretty eye? She says, oh, they're green. So brown eyes or light brown eyes aren't pretty. My son, both my children have brown eyes. My kids don't have my eyes and I'm glad they don't have my eyes because I think their eyes are beautiful as is. Especially, I love, the thing I love about brown eyes, brown eyes is when the sun touches y'all's eyes, it is so beautiful. Like when my son and daughter, and even my husband too, because he has brown eyes. Like even when, when the sun is like glistening and I'm looking at them and I'm just like, dang, they look so handsome and gorgeous. And even my husband, he, you know, and the thing about it is, I was just out telling my husband about it. Like, I love you for who you are and I don't love you because of how you look. And we have so much shit that happens when it comes to those who are darker. And it's like, I would never want someone to treat my husband or my children differently because they're a little bit darker or like, cause my son, he's a little, I say he's, he's light, he's light, but he's darker than me. So if you're darker than me, you're, you're, you know, but my daughter, she's brown skin and my husband is dark skin. Is he dark skin? They darker than me. That's all that matters. But they're beautiful, you know, and I'm not, I don't want the world to tr mistreat them because in their eyes, they're not worthy of being beautiful you know like when i see a woman or a man who's darker than me period because i'm pale y'all know i'm pale you know i feel like damn they are so beautiful and i hope that they know they're beautiful like i tell women all the time like you are beautiful love your skin and you know love what you are like i even have family family members in my family who are dark with color eyes and if she would have just said like i want my child to have color eyes maybe the world would have been a little bit more receptive but you're sitting up there saying oh i want my child to have pretty eyes and it's like well what classifies as be pretty you know like so you're dim diminishing those who have brown eyes or my dad he has like i wouldn't say brown but like you know how like your eyes are like they look black like 
like they look black and you know i was looking at this photo like you, they look black and i used to look my dad eyes like dang dad like your eyes are so dark like you know like it's like a little you can look at them and then i have friends who have brown eyes and they look like the teddy bear eyes like my girlfriend who i went to her 30th birthday party i always tell her all the time like your eyes are beautiful and don't ever sit up there and let someone because uh, yeah me and her was out one day right we were at fridays right and someone came up to us and they said, oh, you have beautiful eyes. And I was looking at her like, you do have beautiful eyes. So you can't say people don't go around saying that those who have brown eyes don't get compliments because my son gets, my son and my daughter get compliments. And it's not even about that. It's like, when I see my children, I see how beautiful they are. And I'm just so thankful that they're here. Secondly, you went through IVF to get your daughter and that's what you're worried about is what her eyes look like. And don't try to blame people from putting clips together because many people have said they went and watched your vlog and it was, you kept talking about skin color, you kept talking about this and that. And it's like, you're focusing on the aspects that don't even matter. It's like, are you raising a great human being? I prefer you to raise a great human being than how they look. And that's why us light skin, other light skin women who are not colorists, we get the short end of the stick because we have people like that who go out here in this world and make it seem like they are so much better than everyone else. Like my two dark skin friends tell them all the time how beautiful they are and never let no one tell you that you are not beautiful. Like all my friends are darker than me, but it doesn't matter. I think they are so beautiful. But the last point I wanted to say on these people should have been canceled because they do i think youtube is evolving past the pranks i think it's to the point where we know they're fake we know that and i feel like too like if you're married there's certain things that you shouldn't be doing and i try not to be judgmental on this youtube because i think it is a great way for you to express your creativity and but it gets to the point where you're uploading content that is just you're trying to pull it, your pull it, your fan, your fa friends or fam's heart, and it's like for what? Like y'all had a whole college that y'all were scamming people out of money. Then you had this big breakup, you know, where you were trying to get the views. And at some point, it's like, is it worth it? If is it worth people looking at you like? Is that all you're worried about? I mean, YouTube is a great way to make in money and income. You know, there are a lot of full time YouTubers that I watch. But I, I think I'm past the, the phase of pranks. I, I prefer more challenges than anything. And if it is a prank, it's not always a cheating prank. I feel like those things really affect people mentally. And that's why a lot of YouTube couples don't last on this platform. But I hope you guys like this video. I just wanted to kind of give my reaction on it because I am a light-skinned woman and I am far from colors. I feel like... If anything, if I had my way, I would be darker. <laughs> I tell my friends this all the time in my family. Like my dad is dark, you know, and my um, my older siblings are darker. And I would just never want someone to mistreat them because in their eyes, they are not considered beautiful. You know, can't even say pretty. Like what the fuck consists of pretty? Like, are you a good human being? Do you treat people good? That's what matters to me. <laughs> so I hope you guys like this video. I'm prefer not to bash people but what I do believe in is being enter when you have a huge platform there's just certain things you should and should not do and they are one of them and that's why I don't watch them so until the next video